We start tonight with an update from the ABC 15 investigators. State records claim multiple failures on the part of a Goodyear long-term care facility where an employee is accused of impregnating a patient. Here's ABC 15 investigator Ann Ryman with details on where state regulators say the facility fell short when it came to protecting a resident. This is Palm Valley Post Acute, a long-term care center in Goodyear, a facility under state scrutiny. ABC 15 obtained this report that shows the Arizona Department of Health Services launched an investigation last year. According to the report, a resident telling state inspectors she was raped 15 to 20 times by a staffer and that the incident replays in her head over and over. ADHS issuing multiple citations to Palm Valley, writing in a report, despite allegations of sexual abuse on September 28th, October 17th, November 3rd, there was no evidence the allegations were investigated until weeks later on November 18th. The staffer was not suspended until November 13th, weeks after allegations were made. The facility failed to immediately report the sexual abuse allegations to ADHS, as is required. According to the report, one administrator at Palm Valley told state inspectors the facility could have done a better job and could have dug deeper on the incident. ADHS issuing Palm Valley multiple citations and requiring them to make changes such as staff training. When somebody says something, it's supposed to immediately be investigated and it also should be reported. And even if it's just alleged and you still don't know, but you need to you need to take action right away. Otherwise, you're keeping all the other residents at risk as well. Palm Valley issuing a statement to ABC 15 saying in part that their internal investigation began on September 28th, but at that time did not uncover any evidence of inappropriate behavior. The statement goes on to say, we will continue to cooperate with authorities as they complete their investigation. As ABC 15 reported last week, the nursing assistant voluntarily surrendered his certification after the allegations. According to documents, he told the nursing board he believed he was having consensual sex with the patient. Goodyear police telling ABC 15 they are also investigating the former staffer. I'm investigator Ann Ryman, ABC 15, Arizona.